Well, we ended the year with a great celebration. A longtime resident of the NSPCA was adopted. We featured him twice on the Morning Blend last year. Joe Starr found a home. And now we are back with Amy Lee to celebrate and find a home for another deserving, loving animal. Hi, Amy. Happy New Year. Happy New Year to you. We're really excited about Joe Starr. What a great way to kick off the new year, right? I was just so touched by your, I found out by the social media post from the NSPCA, Joe Starr went home with the family. Um, you know, it's hard, I know, when you have some of these dogs that are longtime residents in the shelter, you know how wonderful they are, but finding them a home is kind of a different thing. This week, it's all about Bo. Introduce us to Bo. So this handsome boy is three and a half years old, and I don't know why he hasn't found a home yet. He's a big potato and a big love bug. Um, he's just a big boy, and he's ready to join you on your couch. I mean, he's a tank, and he's so great, and I love him. <laughs> he is just so mushy. I love him, too. He's adorable. Uh, what do you think would make a great home for him? I just had this flash that, God, he'd be a great dog to run with. I've kind of kicked up my running in the new year. What do you think? Well, he's, he, he, like I said, he's kind of a tank. He's about 90 pounds, um, so he's kind of a dog that would be great for long walks. Um, he's definitely a Netflix uh, cuddle buddy for sure. Aww. Loves to play. Um, he's just a really, just a fun, big, smushy love bug, uh, cuddle bug. He does have to be the only dog in the home, um, but he is gonna make such a wonderful family member. I mean, he's already, like, he's just been climbing into my lap and just giving me kisses. He's a beautiful boy. Is he a pit bull? Is he a bull mix? What do we know about his breed, perhaps? Sure. Yeah, he's a, he, we've got him down as a bully mix. You know, we don't, you know, I think breeds can be a little bit misleading. So we always really want people to focus on their personality and how they click with that animal. And, you know, I will say, like, he's just got truly a, a shining personality. So I think anybody that comes down to meet him is going to see just how sweet and loving and just he's just a loving dog. He is such a loving dog. And I have to tell you, I spent, um, I had a little time off, Amy, which I needed really badly over the holidays. And I had, a lot of it was spent with my two rescue dogs. I also celebrated the anniversary of rescuing my dog on the 1st, on January 1st. I've had her now for 12 years. Um, she's really just literally one of my best friends. I love my dog so much. Um, this month is a great time to rescue an animal. Of course, we don't want people just to rush into the decision. We want them to understand the obligation. Um, but what will be happening at the shelter over the month of January? Oh my gosh. Well, you know, we're always like, like we always do, we're always focused on finding great homes for these great animals. And, you know, our adoption counselors spend a great deal of time talking to potential adopters to make sure that they have the right fit. We have these really wonderful meet and greet rooms and a play yard outside uh, where potential adopters can come in and meet and you can meet a couple of different animals and we'll talk with you and kind of walk through what we know about that animal um, since they've been in the shelter. And, you know, we're really committed to finding homes for not just dogs, but the cats and the bunnies and the guinea pigs that we have here at the shelter at Nevada SPCA. That's right. There's a lot of, lot of loving uh, little pups and kitties and all kinds of creatures at the NSPCA. And by the way, if people are a little bit afraid of coming down to the shelter, um, I know that can be a little intimidating because um, for people who are really sympathetic to pets, you know, they're worried about, are they being taken care of? You know, what's going to happen to them? NSPCA is a no-kill shelter. They have so many amazing partners here in town. And, um, you know, it takes, it takes a little bit of funding, of course, to make you... To, to make you be able to do what you do. And um, thank you, Amy, by the way, for everything that you do here in the new year, you and the whole staff there. Um, Best Mattress is a great supporter of Rescue and they are providing a dog bed for whoever might adopt Bo. Um, someone else who loved dogs a lot, a celebrity we all remember quite fondly, Betty White. Uh, that's right. You know, Betty White's birthday uh, is coming up. She she last year would have been 100 years old, uh, but her birthday and her memory is coming up on the 17th of January. We want to celebrate and honor her memory. And you know, last year it was it was such a, a, a sad loss to to the community and to the world. I mean, she was a treasure, um, really unexpected. And people came out to help support and donate, and we were so touched and moved by that. You know, Nevada SBC operates completely on donor dollars, um, your money is what helps us do what we do medically and, and to run this facility, like you said. Um, so, you know, we're gonna honor Betty White again and keep her memory alive. It is a great time to donate and support the cause. If you 
uh, have a heart for animals, then definitely think of supporting the NSPCA and meeting Bo. Okay, if we want to come down and meet Bo, can we just walk in? Do we need to make an appointment? How do we get this handsome dog adopted? Oh my gosh, we are going to make it as easy as possible for you. We're an open shelter. We're a walk-in shelter. We're open Monday through Friday, 10 to 5, Saturday, 10 to 6. Come in and ask to meet Bo. This guy's been here for longer than he should. Come on. And I mean, this guy really wants to, he loves going to the park and just kind of hanging out. And I mean, like I said, he wants to just be around the company of people. He loves people. Um, oh. Come in, just ask to meet Bo and we'll, we'll get him out for you. You'll meet him and you'll fall in love. He has just the cutest face. I love this dog. Amy Lee, one of the great staff at the Nevada SPCA. Thank you so much for joining us today. Thank you. All right, let's get Bo adopted. Reach out to the NSPCA. And thank you again to the kind folks at Best Mattress for making sure we can profile an adoptable dog each and every Thursday.